Today we're making a bed frame. I found a design online that I really liked, but it was out of my budget, so I decided to make my own for literally a tenth of the cost. I'm Kirsten Dunn, and this is Dunn DIY. The first thing you'll need to do is cut the wood to size. You can get it cut at Dunn Lumber, or you can use a chop saw at home. There are lots of cuts, so remember, measure twice, cut once. Pre-drill everything with a Craig jig. These holes will hide the hardware for a streamlined look. Grab an electric sander to smooth out each piece of wood, paying special attention to the sides that will be showing. I wanted a worn, gray finish, so I created a custom stain by mixing two Minwax colors. Follow the directions on the side of the can, then let dry fully. So we're starting out by attaching the 2x4s to the 2x6s, mm -hmm. and this is going to make up the skirt of the bed. The 2x4 makes a support for the bed slats to rest on, and the 2x6 is the decorative front. Using the short posts as a guide, mark the top of the short post on the two inside corners of the tall posts. Now it's time to do the headboard. Attach one of the short skirts to one of the tall posts aligning the top edge of the skirt with the mark you made. Repeat the step at the other end with the other tall post. It helps to have an extra set of hands. Put a 2x3 in between the posts and on top of the front of the skirt. Put a 2x12 right next to the 2x3. It should rest on the inside support piece. Secure everything with Craig jig screws. Next, attach the long sides to the headboard, matching the marks on the tall posts. Next, it's time to create the footboard. Attach the remaining short skirt to one of the short posts, aligning the top edge of the skirt with the top of the post. Repeat this step at the other end with the other short post. Attach the foot to the rest of the bed. Slide in the tongue and groove headboard pieces on top of the 2x3 and attach to the posts with Craig jig screws. Next, add a cap to finish the look. Attach it to the 2x12 and on top of the skirt. Place one board across the length of the bed for extra support, then secure with screws. Next, place slats no more than two and a half inches apart. For more DIY tips, tricks, and step-by-step -step tutorials, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit us at DoneDIY.com.